as it gets hotter, uh, you want to be able to cook outside. It's so much more fun, um, you know, to be outside by the barbecue when it's a really nice hot day. Um, and you can really just with that summer feel do simple food and elevate it really easily by just changing it up a little. So I'm gonna do like a classical bufala tomato uh, caprese salad, but I'm just gonna grill it a little bit just to bring it up a bit. And then I'm gonna use instead of sardines like they would in Italy, I'm using I believe these is Coriakinos fish. Um, you can see it over here. Really simply enough just to marinate for the fish. We're gonna start with just some garlic. So about one clove for each fish. Then we're just gonna slice it up. We don't really need to chop it or anything. It's nice and thin. Just dump that onto our fish. Then we're gonna get some fresh rosemary that I have here. Quick chop as well. Then we're just gonna take some nice olive oil, put about a tablespoon or two with the fish, with the thyme. You see the flavors are just already building here, which is fantastic. I'm gonna grab some salt, put that there, some nice rock salt. Some black pepper on top. Then I'm gonna finish it off with just a little lemon here. So I'm just gonna get some of the peel, which I'm just gonna cut with a knife. And I'm just gonna chop it. So it's like little chunks of lemon, it's not just rind. Put that there as well. So that's it for the fish, we're gonna let it chill there. Uh, now we're gonna do the vegetables, really simply enough. I've got two tomatoes, right? And I'm gonna use one red pepper, all right? Get the olive oil, smear it a little bit everywhere on both. Take my sharp knife, make tiny incisions, and I'm just gonna plop it right onto our grill here until it gets nice and charred. So when the, the vegetables are about halfway done, we're just gonna slap on our, our fish in here. You see the vegetables I'm cooking on, on pretty much indirect heat because I don't want too much flames going on. It's gonna get too charred. Here I'm gonna let the, 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 the flames lick it a little bit as it comes out with the olive oil and then it's just gonna cook really quickly at about three, four minutes each side. The fish, which is very delicate, is pretty much cooked, so we're just gonna flop that on to a plate here directly. So I got this beautifully charred tomato over here. What I'm gonna do is just really slice into it quite easily. Just like that, we're gonna do small slices. You see it's nice and juicy, but what I like about it, it has that smokiness from the grill. And then to that, we're gonna add just our pepper here, just to give it a nice fiery edge. All right, just a couple of slices. And then we're just gonna fix that onto our dish here. It's a nice warm tomato. And then I'm gonna take some bufala mozzarella. You don't even need to use a knife here, just tear up some pieces here and there. And on top of it, a couple of chilies. Now you might think that you might need a dressing or something to go with it, but you don't really, really do because there's so many natural flavors that are so perfect in there. So just some black pepper, a little bit of rock salt, both on the fish and on the salad. And we're just gonna finish with some nice lemon juice on top, some freshness, We've got beautiful herbs. You can even use some of the olive oil that I used to marinate the fish. Uh, with some garlic just to put and finish on top like that. And we've got a really fresh dish that is perfect for summer, basically.